Christmas Day 15. <laughs> Let me catch my breath. Ooh, my darlings, welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how we prepare Onunu. In case you don't know what Onunu is, Onunu is one of River State's most famous delicacy. And I'm going to show you guys how we prepare Onunu. Okay, so that's why I am dressed like a reverse woman, hmm? a proper reverse woman. Okay, my darlings, I'm going to be pounding yam. Hmm? <laughs> I'm going to be pounding yam for you guys. No, for you guys. Huh? For my hobby and his friend. Okay, yes. I want to use this special delicacy to, you know, host oh, hobby and his friend. Okay. So yeah, that's the reason why I'm going to be preparing this meal. But definitely, I'll be showing you guys how we prepare this food in River State. But I must say this, my darlings. This onunu is um, mostly consumed by the riverine people like the Calabaris, the Opopos, the Andonis, you know. I am Ikwewe, okay? And we also consume this onunu. So just because Hobby's friend that is coming is from the riverine area, that is why I have decided to welcome him to our home with this special delicacy as a proper Rivers woman. This is not the kind of food you would see every day. Eh? It's not easy to prepare onunu because of you know the energy, the hard work that goes into it. Don't worry, guys. By the time I start preparing this food, you get to understand why I said it's not the kind of food that you prepare every day. When you go to a proper rivers restaurant and ask them how much is a plate of onunu, then you would understand why this food is a special food. So you want to sit back, relax, and enjoy watching. How a proper river woman like me <laughs> prepares onunu the local way, eh? not the English way that you have been seeing in YouTube. No, I'm gonna show you how we prepare this food the proper river way. So please, while you watch, do not forget to encourage me by liking this video. Like I always say, it goes a long way in encouraging me and it also helps my channel grow. My darlings, I am ready. I mean, I came prepared for this Vlogmas video. This is just Vlogmas Day 15. I have 10 more videos coming up for you guys. So you don't want to go anywhere. If this is your first time of coming across my channel, you are welcome to Becky the Mommy's YouTube channel. Please do not forget to hit the subscribe button and after you do that, also tap on the notification bell so you get notified each time I drop a new video. So my darlings, now let's start cooking. But let me introduce you guys to the ingredients first. Okay my darlings, now these are the key ingredients I'll be using to prepare our famous Onunu Delicacy. As you can see my darlings, this is ripe plantain. This is um, very ripe. As you can see and this is very very sweet I mean when it's um, ripe up to this stage it makes the uh, onunu very sweet and also the pounding of the yam very easy and very smooth okay so these are the local spices I'll be using to you know prepare the pepper soup with this um, cut fish here is Buddha okay and um, I'll write down the name of this one in English and also the name of this okay so this is um, onion I'll be pounding the onion with crayfish and fresh pepper. Okay, my darlings, this is a um, scent leaf. We call this medenji in Ikwere dialect. Okay, I got this from my garden, and this is definitely the tuber of yam I'll be using, you know, to make this onunu. So the onunu is yam and plantain pounded together and paired with catfish pepper soup. Now relax and enjoy watching the preparation of this. Delicacy! Oh, 
blessing in my life will The highest blessing in my wife oh. She know how to sweet in my life will How to cool on my heart Cause they know not the man The day in no day She go the manage you My wife oh. My wife oh. My life, my everything now My wife oh. She love me better My darlings, I have to explain this in a voiceover. Okay, this is how you cut Oyayak spice because I've seen some people put the whole um, full stick inside. No, you cut the spice and then you throw the other part away, okay? Um, this is Uda that I'm adding. I mean, I added the spices first, um, then allowed it to cook for a while. At least let the aroma of the spices you know, come up before I added the fish, okay? You know, this is a video and it's in, in speed, so I just have to explain everything properly with a voiceover, okay? So this is a scent leaf and this is how we cut it. Okay, we don't use knife to cut this scent leaf, you use your fingers. So after cutting the scent leaf and of course the prep soup was um, less like 90% almost ready before I added the scent leaf. So the scent leaf will just, you know, cook with the pepper soup for a while, you know, give it its own aroma, its own taste and um, that's that. <laughs> So yes, what I'm doing here is I'm just mixing the the whole pepper soup, just mixing everything together, you know, so the taste and everything will just mix properly. That's the best way I can explain this, my darling. <laughs> so after doing this whole turning, I'm not turning vigorously because I don't want the fish to pieces, okay? I want to serve the fish in full. <laughs> so after, um, you know, having a taste of the pepper soup and I'm sure everything is... Um, okay i covered it up to you know cook for a few minutes and by this time the plantain and the yam was ready so this is where the whole work is i mean this is where the onunu work is okay so what you see me doing here is of course i'm just adding the i'm transferring the yam rather to the mother and thereafter i will start pounding everything together but as you can see i started pounding the yam first Okay? <laughs> Now my darling, at this point I started adding the ripe plantain, okay, but I had to, you know, pound the um, yam to a point where it's almost ready before adding the ripe plantain. Now what the plantain is going to do is, it's going to make the yam very, very smooth as you can see and then the pounding process now will be very easy because of the ripe plantain. So after pounding for a while, I added the palm oil. The palm oil, it's what gives it that you know that yellowish color and then it also makes the pounding process as well easy okay so my darlings as you can see the plantain and the yam mixture is very smooth at this point and it's seedless okay <laughs> now my pepper soup is ready and i'm ready to serve my darlings i must say this Onunu is <laughs> Onunu meal. I mean Onunu delicacy 
is amazing i'm sorry i know i use the word amazing a lot but that's the best way i can you know describe this food this delicacy onunu is one food a rivers man do not joke with i mean a proper home trained rivers man <laughs> this food is 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 one in a million here in river state is our local delicacy and we do not joke with it okay so my darlings i have obviously come to the end of vlogmas day 15 and i hope you enjoyed watching thank you very much my darlings i hope to see you tomorrow in vlogmas day 16 bye bye